definitely doesn't feel like it, but tomorrow is a home opener for the Minnesota Twins. Uh, the Tim begins its ninth season at Target Field in downtown Minneapolis. Every major sports team in the state is enjoying a new or relatively new home. How much have they cost taxpayers? Here's Pat Kessler's reality check. Target Field is regarded as one of the best baseball parks in America. Part of a remarkable 20 year Twin City stadium building boom for every major sport. Beginning in 1998, Minnesota built or substantially renovated seven major sports facilities XL Energy Center, Target Field, CHS Field for the Saints, TCF Bank Stadium for the Gophers, U.S. Bank Stadium for the Vikings, Target Center for the Timberwolves and Lynx and Allianz Arena for Minnesota United. You might call this a golden age for stadium building, and it is. This hasn't happened here before. The Golden Goose, Minnesota taxpayers. In 2018 dollars, all of these stadiums together cost a total of $2.5 billion, and Minnesota taxpayers shelled out 56% of it, $1.4 billion. We're no different from anywhere else. The Brookings Institution reports 45 U.S. sports stadiums built or renovated between 2000 and 2014. The cost $28 billion, and the public paid $13 billion of it. Back in Minnesota, one big exception. The new St. Paul home for Minnesota United Soccer, Allianz Arena, got no direct public funding. But the city did provide $18 million worth of roads and water lines, the owners paying the $200 million stadium cost themselves. That's Reality Check.